Okay, so I have to um, expand the map a little bit and add to it. Um, okay, this is a tough subject. Uh, identifying generations and categorizing triggers into their respective generations um, because this is probably well at least this is my attempt at trying to resolve kind of a difficult issue when tackling um, the ranking system obviously there are clear generational differences and it's actually not locked to a person's age it's actually very very context-based and uh, some of the factors that contribute towards which generation a trigger will fall into um, It's kind of the time period that battlers were battling in but also it's kind of where are they mentally where What what metagame are the triggers performing? You know, are they still doing the mid uh, 2010s, you know era 2010 to 2018 generation 2 Michael Guthrie style of battling or are they slightly earlier than that are they doing a lot more of the more aggressive more groundwork oriented a lot more originality but less power but much better kicks and much better execution generation 1 style of battling or are they straight up next level power um, Ne just next level everything like generation three generation three obviously being spearheaded by Shose, and generation two being spearheaded by michael guthrie generation one i would say probably the best battler that um represents his generation is daniel graham um maybe um chris, chris alfonso maybe from striking z but I feel like Danny G really encapsulated Generation 1 battling. Sashomaru might be Gen 0, but I think Steve Tarada is kind of grandfathered into that role just because of how much he contributed at very crucial parts of history. But um, yeah, there are clear differences between generations and how they battle. And so part of how I'm going to be categorizing triggers is um, it doesn't matter if it doesn't really matter what your age is necessarily, but it matters more what era tricking are you performing, uh, which meta game are you reciting, you know, um, and were you participating during that era, you know. So th there's going to be triggers of different age groups who are going to be Gen two, Gen three, Gen one, etc., and it might look off because you'd wonder like. How is Danny Etkin, who's like 20 years old or whatever, almost the same age as Shosei, how come he's not in the same generation as Shosei? Well, if you look at his, the way he battles, if you look at um, who he was mentored by, you know, he was mentored by Generation 1 Tricker, Matt Emig, right? So his style, his attitude, the way he battles is very much in line with Generation 2. And he battled in that part of the world, you know, alongside these Trickers like Michael Guthrie. So there are concurrent generations that are taking place even at the same point in history. So that's the, the cool thing about tricking and how complex it is. And it's just an attempt at articulating reality. It's not like I'm making this up. This is just observing what is and trying to communicate it, right? To have a greater understanding. Um, what I'm doing with the map right now is I'm just adding um, a little marker that indicates um, so the size of the circle is really to demonstrate the population. Um, you know, so South Korea, for example, has a very large population, whereas Japan has probably a smaller population of trickers. Um, the color obviously indicates uh, which generation it falls into. So um, Finland obviously is very inspired by modern day tricking and the coach over there, coaches, are pushing their athletes to adopt modern day training practices and modern day mentality when it comes to battling and so obviously the athletes that are being produced in that part of the world are Gen 3, um, pseudo Gen 4 as well because Gen 4 is going to pop up with Mito leading the pack there. Um, but in other parts of the world, you know, as you'll, you'll see here, um, Western Europe has a very, very large population but it's still kind of locked into the, the Michael Guthrie era of tricking. 
same with the usa usa of course obviously there are exceptions it's it's not one size fits all but i would say that the vast majority of battlers in the usa are still kind of um, inspired by the michael guthrie metagame um, canada obviously we're um, a much much smaller population and uh, your average battler uh, is kind of gen one ish you know kind of basic Mexico as well, you know, um, but I actually still have to do a lot more work and a lot more research I still have to gain a greater understanding of the population um, But yeah, so Hmm, is there anything more to say? I wonder um, Yeah, I'm still working on the rankings and it's gonna take a while because I have a lot. There's a lot to do but um this all helps to tie into the, the overall bigger picture, which I'm trying to um, articulate to the best of my ability. But I just thought it was really fascinating that we could all live in the same year, but all sort of be, like in reality, we all live in the same year, but that's not where everyone is at mentally and emotionally. You, some people are living in their preferred day, their preferred era. And I just thought it was really cool. It's like if you travel to somewhere like Japan where it's very futuristic and very modern, you'll see that um, the architecture is very different, like the way of living is different. If you go to other parts of Europe, it's like stepping back in time. It's, I just thought it was really cool. Um, but yeah, you're gonna see that a lot of trickers are, you're gonna look at the ranking system and be like, okay, hmm, this, I don't know if this looks right. They're not all in the same age group. Well, it's not, determined by age, it's going to be determined by context. Uh, it's all relative to one another, right? So, um, yeah, that's the problem that I'm just focusing on right now. So I'm trying to mark, I'm trying to, to get a, a good grasp. I think Russia, actually I should probably move Russia to a more modern day. They do have some pretty advanced and complex combos there with very good power. Um, but maybe your average tricker is probably Gen 2-ish.